Hello everyone! A happy New Year! I am starting off this year with a get ready with me video. This is just my daily makeup routine. I have two actually. Basically one just with lashes and then one just with a little bit of eyeshadow. Today I am going to do some eyeshadow but it's the same routine basically. I already prepped my skin. But I went in with this first. Then some sunscreen. And then my holy grail, I love this stuff. You can get it at Target um, or Walmart. I found it at Walmart. I love this so much. I am not a makeup artist by any means. This is just how I do my makeup. This just works for me. Um, so if you see something out of sequence or whatever, sorry. <laughs> I already filled in my eyebrows and I'm gonna go ahead and conceal them off camera as well. And then we'll start with the eyes because I start with the eyes okay so eyebrows are all done um, there's not I don't really do much to them because they're naturally thick so there's really not that much shaping that I do kind of just stay along like the natural shape of them um, and then conceal them so today I'm gonna go into a new palette which I'm re really excited about I recently went to Ulta and I picked up a couple things so I picked up the That's Topi palette from ColourPop and I'm so excited to look. Ugh. Opening up a palette is so satisfying. Ooh, so pretty. I think I want to go into Boa, which is this one right here. Uh, I'm going to go in with this brush right here. I'm just going to put this all over my lid. I'm just going to see how it looks. So how was everybody's Christmas and New Year's? I got a tripod for Christmas, which I'm using right now. And I love it. I love the quality of it. It's very sturdy and just really good quality. Okay, so from what I'm seeing, I don't know if I need to use more. I feel like it's really like a base color. Okay, so I'm gonna use this other brush. It's kind of like an angled brush and I'm gonna go into Pebble Beach. See how that looks. Just right here. Hmm. Really pretty. I always love the <laughs> in makeup videos. Just blend my life away. Love this palette. Absolutely love this palette. So cute. So after that, I'm going to do some eyeliner. I always have to do like a thin black line before I do before I do my lashes. I have to prepare myself for this. Even though it's like, you know, I'm not doing a wing or anything. Um... I still like don't ever want to make it too thick. So now I'm going in with mascara. Just the Maybelline Lash Sensational. Oh my gosh, I forgot to tell y'all. While I was doing, while I was concealing my eyebrows off camera, I got a call from... Uh, this new job that I'm about to start and I'm so excited right now. We're just figuring out When my start date is but I'm so excited to be Going into this new year At a really awesome company I'm gonna get another call Soon actually so I'm not in a rush but kind of in a rush. So I'm gonna go in with these lashes I have used this brand of lashes since like college. I love these. I 
I love these lashes uh, so much. So this is in the style M218. These are like my like everyday lashes. Um, they're not super, super natural, but they're natural to, for me. Um, and then like if I'm going out or something, I will use these in the style M314. I love these as well. So these are like my going out lashes. But today we're gonna use M218. Got the duo glue. Fun fact, I've never gotten like my lashes done. Um, I don't know. I've just heard so many things about it. Um, I remember one of my aunts told me that like her real lashes started falling out. Um, and I don't know, but I know there's so many benefits. I mean, it makes your whole makeup routine like super faster obviously but yeah i've never i've never tried eyelash extensions and is it just me or like i think this is like my ocd i don't know but every time i do my makeup i have to have a little napkin um to clean off like the excess before like i put the lid back on because i just hate when it gets all gross lashes are on So I'm just going to spray some of this. It smells so good, y'all. Like, y'all have to get it. So for foundation, I'm going to go in with the Superstay Maybelline in the shade 220 Natural Beige. Oh, well, I put a lot on my hand I should probably use my mirror because I can't see anything <laughs> da, 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 da. I am a full coverage kind of girl always have been always will be well Seeing the eyeshadow like with the foundation looks so good. I love this eyeshadow. Don't forget the neck, y'all. Don't forget the neck. So next up for concealer, I am gonna go in with the LA Girl Pro Conceal. I still use this. I love it. I, I haven't gotten away from it. I did recently pick up though the um the elf concealer and i like it but uh this is my go-to and this is in the shade gc 969 porcelain everyone's favorite part so now we blend our life away okay so to bake i use the airspun loose face powder uh translucent extra coverage 07041 i mean i've heard that this i don't know is bad for you but i like it i like it a lot so i'm gonna need more proof no i'm just kidding now I'm just pressing it in. Now that I have pressed all the powder into my skin. For bronzer, I'm going in with Sugar Rush. I heard you're supposed to tap. But I don't know. Sometimes I remember to tap and then sometimes I don't. Mm, I can still smell like the rose water. It smells so good. 
What I love about this bronzer is that there is a little bit of shine to it. Like as I'm putting it on, like I can see like up here the, the little shininess. You guys, I just forgot a step. I literally forgot a really important step. Oh my gosh. I got that call and it just made me like so excited that I just completely forgot what I was doing. Okay, so let me tell y'all how I messed up. I forgot my primer. I would normally put this on. So this is the primer that I told you guys about that my sister told me about. The Power Grip Elf Primer. I would normally put this on after I do my eyes and everything. So after I did my eyes, I would have put this on. Then I would have sprayed my rose water. Yeah, forgot this step. Um, it's okay. It's okay. She's she's looking great. She's looking great. And not that I am going anywhere super important. If I like were to have a whole day ahead of me or if I'm going out at night, this is definitely a step that I don't want to forget because I want my makeup to stay, want it to last. And I literally had it sitting right there. Then I kind of just take a little bit of translucent powder and um like if it drag down too much i just kind of go underneath that bronzer just to lighten it up and then whatever excess i just blend it in where i put that bronzer on my forehead like that what i also picked up at ulta was was this milani blush so pretty so this one is in the shade 05 Luminoso. So we're going to try this out today. Literally right before I did this, I was watching TikToks and I saw this like blush hack. I also got this brush too, this e.l.f. blush brush while I was at Ulta. So this is new as well. Okay, this girl said to basically get some translucent powder on the brush. And then basically go into the blush and then let's see what happens. Oh babe, she's cute. Mm -hmm. Wow, she's shiny. I like already feel shiny. I feel like I'm not gonna need highlighter. I'm still gonna put it on. I love it. Super luminous. I absolutely love it. Definitely recommend. So glad I got that. I am going to do my nose contour. And for that, I just use an eyeshadow. So I'm gonna go into this ColourPop palette that I've had for a while. It's called Truly Madly Deeply. And I'm going to go into this shade called Golden Gate Bridge. And this is what I contour my nose with. Kind of bring it into my eyebrows. This literally like takes me the longest. Okay, so I'm going to take some translucent powder now and kind of lighten that up a little bit. There it is. Y'all, I'm actually obsessed with that blush. I'm going to go into It's So Beat Up. The Revolution Highlighter. Dare to Divulge, that's my favorite highlighter. I love it, super cheap. Um, so I pretty much just go in with my finger and put a little bit, and then I'm gonna put a little bit on the tip of my nose and then up here, period. A little bit more. 
So for the last and final thing, we are gonna do lips now. So my lip combo, I'm gonna go in with the NYX Professional SPL 855 Nude Truffle. And then the NYX Professional Suede in Dainty Days. Love this lip combo, it's my favorite. the best before my camera dies this is the final look okay I'm back I had to charge my camera but this is the final look super simple on the eyeshadow if I'm really in a rush then I just won't do eyeshadow I'll, I'll just have lashes on but yeah I'm gonna get changed show you guys my outfit and where should I go I feel like I should go somewhere Target maybe look at some office decor fit check so this is the fit for today Thank you guys so much for watching this Get Ready With Me. Once again, Happy New Year. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.